good morning. I hope you're feeling it awesome. Let's, let's go through three exercises to dominate the lower body today. Now, obviously, we know that the core has to work no matter what I do. If I just reach over here, my core is working. As I'm talking, my core is working. So we know that. That's a gift. I'm going to get a little more shoulder involvement because I've got my medicine ball with me. But really, we're going to dominate with the hips and legs with these three exercises. Very simple, very quick, straight to it. Do it in a circuit. Do five to ten reps. Five if you're a beginner, eight intermediate, up to ten. If you're ready to go get it, do a circuit format. So that means do one, short rest, do the next, short rest, do the following. Uh, the last one, if you want to challenge your heart rate more, give less rest. If you want to challenge your power more, give more rest in between. Okay, so wherever you want to meet this, this exercise, that's where you meet it. First one, we're going to do an RDL, but it's a single leg with a kickstand. So here's my kickstand. Now, this leg really is not involved other than a little bit of balance. I'm going to pivot forward at the hip. Notice my back stays flat, and then I'm going to drive up and bring the knee up. Now, if you're uncomfortable bringing the knee up, just step here. All right, so we're going to knock out 10 of these on each leg. All right, now, if I want to drive up, as I go back and I come forward, I just bring the knee up, which finishes with the hip. I would switch to the other leg. Short rest. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to my military squat. So I've got my leg that I'm going to work. I'm going to take the other leg and go right at about the heel with my toe. And I'm going to keep this front leg completely flat. This leg is still that kickstand. I'm not really using it much. But now I'm going to dominate more with the front side and my glutes. My hips are going to certainly work, but those quads are now working. If I want to make my balance feel a little different, I can change the position of the ball based on what I'm after, okay? Once I finish that, now I'm going to go laterally with control of the transverse plane because I'm going to move the ball kind of diagonal, which forces me to have rotational control. So I'm going to get kind of wide, I'm going to squat on this leg, because i that's the leg I've been working. What I'm going to do is I'm going to squat down. So if you watch me this way, the foot stays flat. My knee comes forward. I'm not going like this. I'm going to squat, all right? Hip back, knee forward, foot flat, heel on the ground, okay? But I'm going to take the ball from high on one side, reach low on the other. Be explosive on this. So I'm getting some really good core work, controlling this rotation finishing the rotation up here. So, again, if I'm a beginner, I might go really slow. I might not even use my medicine ball. Work on that hinge. Work on that military squat. Work on that side squat, lateral squat. Great workout. Hips are going to get strong. Legs are going to get really strong. Core is going to help support, and you're going to feel some shoulder work as well. Guys, enjoy your day. Have an awesome day. Be safe. Can't wait to see you tomorrow.